Hello guys, it's your boy Drop a Lesson here. Today is going to be the consideration of the Game Week predictions from Game Week 33. And we're going to mention some games from Game Week 34 as well. So without further ado, let's get started. 27th of April, we have Everton against Newcastle. Now, Everton, they managed to get a draw against Palace, whilst Newcastle managed to beat Tottenham by 6 goals to 1. It was a great game to watch. Um, so I'm going to say Newcastle to win that game because they've got the momentum now and... Everton will be struggling. Southampton against Bournemouth. Now, this is a must win game for both these two teams. However, I don't see that happening, so I'm going to say Southampton, as I'm going to say, a draw between those two teams. Tottenham against um, Man United, which happened tomorrow on Thursday. Um, Tottenham, I, will, I don't know about them. The confidence is low. Losing 6 1 against Newcastle. Man United, FA Cup finalists as well, so. Not going to be easy, that's when we're going to see United to win that game. Saturday, the 29th of April, we have Palace against West Ham. Um, Palace, they're quite good at home. West Ham, when they go away, they can struggle. Should be a good game to watch, but I'm going to say Palace to win that game. Brentford against Nottingham Forest. Now, Brentford are a very good side and they're looking to try to get your play places. Nottingham Forest, they still struggle away. Even though they did give Liverpool a good game, though, losing by just 3-2. But I'm going to say Brentford to win that one. Brighton against Wolves. Brighton, a good side, um, home and away. Wolves, they'll be trying to get more points as well. But I don't see nothing but a Brighton win. Sunday, the 3rd of April, we have Bournemouth against Leeds. I already talked about Bournemouth already. Leeds, they're going to be struggling, especially at the back. Uh, I'm going to say Bournemouth to win that game. Fulham against Manchester City. Now, City are playing tonight against um, against Arsenal, so it should be a great game to watch. Whoever wins that game will win the title. And I don't see Fulham beating City. Even if City even get a draw, even lose this game, I can still see City get, um, still beating Fulham. So I'm going to say City win that game. Man United against Villa. You know, United, and they are made to the FA Cup finals. Um, Villa, on great form right now, beating Fulham by one goal to nil. Um, I feel like it's going to be a good game, a very good game. I'm going to say a draw because I think Villa will not let United win the game that easily. Newcastle against Southampton. Newcastle are very good at home and they are quite okay on the road as well. Southampton, they were looking to try like frustrate them, but I don't see that happening. So I'm going to say Newcastle win that game. Liverpool against Tottenham. Liverpool on good form. Tottenham, shaky. Very, very shaky, especially when they lost 6-1 against Newcastle. I'm going to say Liverpool wouldn't win that game because at Anfield, it's not easy to play in there. And yeah, I don't see Tottenham get anything, to be honest. Monday, the 1st of May, we have Leicester and Everton. Now, it's a must-win game for both two, two teams, but I don't see a winner on that one. So I'm going to say draw. Tuesday, the 2nd of May, we have Arsenal against Chelsea. Massive game for... Arsenal, especially if they don't beat um, um, City, but I can see them being Chelsea because Chelsea are rubbish and Chelsea are playing tonight against Brentford, which is not that important to us. So I'm going to say Arsenal with that game. 3rd of May, we have Liverpool against Fulham. Liverpool are good. Fulham, they're also good as well. They're going to try and stay in Europa League places, but I think Liverpool win that game. Man City versus West Ham. Now, West Ham. I don't see having any chance against City. And uh, City with Erling Haaland up front, it's never easy. And all these good players as well, not just Haaland, every good player. Like Mahrez, Greenless, um, John Stones even. But I'm going to say City win that one. City to beat them, West Ham. And then Thursday the 4th of May, we have Brighton against Man United. The FA Cup semi-final rematch. Should be a cracker. It will be a cracking game. But I don't see a winner on that one. So I'm going to say... Brighton. I'm going to say a draw between Brighton and Man United. So those are the um, the those are my predictions for these upcoming games that are coming up very soon. Um, the season is almost hit over, so points is definitely so every point counts really towards this stage. This has been Drop a Lesson here. Take care and bye. -bye.